Hi, everyone. I'm so excited that you are going to join me for the 14-day detox plan that begins on this Wednesday. And if you've already signed up, you will be receiving this uh, 14 day detox uh, drink, you probably may already have received it. Depends on when you signed up for it. So uh, there's also a 50 page document uh, that was attached as a PDF in one of the emails that you should have received from me. I would highly recommend you to read through it, um, but I just want to simplify this. I want to make this easy for you to do. So this detox um, can be done as easy as using this shake two times per day. You can use one scoop in about 10 ounces of water. You can use a bottle like this and fill it up to up to, up, up to 10 ounces with a scoop. Shake it up and use cold water. You could add ice and then you drink it. This is not the only thing that you will do during this program, you will be eating a clean diet, right? When I say clean diet, what I mean is we kind of remove the processed foods, we remove additional sugars, except like from fruits or some natural sweeteners. Or if you like the sweet taste, you could use stevia. And uh, you eliminate dairy, even the grains that may not be suiting you too much or try alternative healthier grains like quinoa or oats, um, millet, buckwheat, just some examples. So you're eating a clean diet, uh, preparing your meals. Right now, because we have the time, I have been preparing my protein shake in the morning using the detox powder. And I've sent my favorite recipe in that YouTube video that I shared with you. Basically, I add a bunch of frozen berries with uh, spinach and kale, apple, banana, put uh, a scoop of the protein drink, the 14 day detox drink is what I mean. Add some coconut milk. Um, I also add chia seeds, flax seeds, water, and I mix it up. You don't have to be all that fancy or if you don't have all of that at home, it's okay. Um, usually when I'm so busy uh, and some of you know at my clinic uh, when I've seen you, I just basically am drinking this when I'm on my way from work to pick up my boys. So do it uh, as it suits your needs. Basically just focus on simplifying your life getting rid of the things that you don't need, eating clean food, and uh, doing the shake. Now, if you follow something like an intermediate fasting plan, you could still continue doing that. You could break your fast by doing the shake. So say if you break your fast like at 10 a.m. or 11 a.m. in the morning, then this would be like your first meal, and you could have that. And then if you're eating up to like 6 p.m., you could have another lunch and dinner and have three meals in a day. Or you could have, um, if you're not following intermittent fasting, you could do like uh, six small meals in a day and you could do one scoop two times a day of this. So this can really fit your needs. Um, there is an example of the food plan that is provided here. Now, don't, uh, you don't have to like stick to this word by word. This is giving you an example of the clean foods to eat and include in your diet. So this uh, document, you know, basically goes into explaining like what is a detox, why you detox. It also gives you grocery lists. So to make it convenient if you're not going to grocery stores and staying home, and if you're using services like Instacart, you could look at these lists, place your order, and then you know pick it up on the curbside. And definitely make sure to sanitize everything, wash all the vegetables and all of that before you use it. That should be done anyways, but I know with the corona situation that we are in, everybody is doing it even more. So definitely use this. And um, if you 
have not joined my Facebook group, if you use Facebook group, I've sent you a link. Uh, click on that link and uh, join the Facebook group where that platform is for you, for me, for all of us to exchange recipes, ask questions and support each other through this. So I know people who have done this plan, you know, have noticed more energy, more clearer thinking, and have also lost some weight depending on how many, you know, uh, carbs or macronutrients you decide to add into your diet and all of that. Remember to get movement uh, even at home, you know, you could do some exercising following some videos or in your backyard, do some jumping jacks, movement is essential. And uh, drink plenty of water while you're detoxing. So I would say aim for a gallon of water a day and see how much you can get in. You could drink uh, green tea during the day. That helps your metabolism, provides you the antioxidants. The key is that all the ingredients that are listed here and the supplement facts, all of them help in the process of detoxification. So the liver you know, has the phase one and phase two of detoxification. And uh, if you're interested, you could read more about it in the document that I have sent you. And it tells you what foods and what vitamins or minerals are essential in which stage. It's very interesting. So I don't want to make this too long, but I just want to again tell you, keep this simple. I always say, I've also written that in my book, life is simple and life can be simple again. So just do this and uh, reach me if you have any questions. Happy detoxing, you guys. Thank you.